Here's problem 10. It says given s is at negative 1, 8, so there's s at negative 1, 8, and t is at 7, negative 9, what is the length? What length just means what? Distance. We're looking for the distance. Now remember the distance formula. The distance formula is basically the square root of subtract the difference of your x is squared plus the difference of our y is squared. I don't even need this picture here. All I need is s and t. I need to subtract my x's. Well, from negative 1 to 7, that's a difference of 8. So I know that's going to be 8 squared plus the change in y's. 8 to negative 9. Well, 8 to 0 is 8. 0 to negative 9 is 9. That's 17 squared. So it's going to be the square root of 64. 17 squared is 289 put those together I get 353. It's going to be the square root of 353 which is choice D right there. Have our answer. That's quite quick and easy. Now again where this comes from is literally in this picture if you drew this all the way down to here and across notice you have a right triangle. The distance from here to here is 8 so that one leg is 8 the distance of the other leg where the right angle meets is 17 and you're using the Pythagorean theorem which says 17 squared plus 8 squared equals C squared and then you're solving all that and you're going to get the 353 is equal to C squared and then you got to take the square root. That's where all that comes from, the distance formula. But as soon as you see it saying what's the length and it gives you two points, right away you should be jumping to the distance formula.